Yo, 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 what is going on, guys? It is your boy, Joe for Snake, guys, coming back at you with another video. And today, we are playing some Infinite Warfare, and I want to talk to you guys about some great news that was just recently announced, uh, like yesterday or so, that this year's Call of Duty and the next coming year, like two or three years, are going to go back to the roots, and it's going to be boots on the ground. They tweeted, they were like, Call of Duty 2017 is going to go back to the roots. So, if that being true, then this year's Call of Duty, the, the rumors about Vietnam, rumors about Vietnam being 2017 is going to come to come to fruition or it's going to be something of the similar sort, you know, somewhere in that era and their cars whizzing by, okay, no need to show off, but I, that that makes me so excited for for Call of Duty, you know, in the future, in the future to come because of the fact that everybody wanted boots on the ground and this game didn't do like it didn't perform well in sales like they said that that it didn't perform well so you know it was just a big outcry and outlash for uh the fans to say we want boots on the ground and this is what we want we want it now and the fact that they're doing it now is it, it's it's good because they listen they finally are listening and that you know nobody wanted the space the space futuristic advanced movement advanced guns you can't even name the guns like half of these guns aren't real it's like nobody wanted that and you know since the next two or three years are going to be back to boots on the ground that is so great for call of duty because it's going to be like a refresh it's going to be like a refresh of call of duty and then all the people that liked it and the reason why you know people started doing gaming channels on it and it's because it was on it was boots on the ground so it felt like war so since they're doing that it's just going to be like a complete reset refresh for all the call of duty fans and you know it might bring back a glimmer of hope for Call of Duty in the future, you know, they might, after, if they do well and make a great, you know, game for 2017 and the next coming years, and they see how much of an improvement it is to the series as a whole, they might stick with it for the, you know, future years to come, you know, it might not go back for a while, and if they do, it'll probably be something very minimalistic, and, oh gosh, so that's what I'm hoping for, hold on, there's a the guy that face shipped over here, I don't know where he is. But yeah, that's what I'm hoping for. But it's been 100% confirmed that it is going to be backwards. No, not backwards compatible. That it is going to go back to the roots of Call of Duty and to the way it was, you know, when it first came out. And, you know, that's why everybody loved Call of Duty for what it was when it first came out back in the olden days where you actually felt like you were in war. You know, that was just a really fun thing to do and to play as, you know. Because now I don't feel like I'm in war when I'm playing Call of Duty or like that it's a war aspect or anything. I kind of just feel like... I'm playing, you know, whatever the title is, like Advanced Warfare, Infinite Warfare. I feel like I'm playing that instead of Call of Duty as itself, you know? Because when you were playing Call of Duty back in the day, you would be playing Call of Duty and it would feel like war, like you're actually in war. But now you're feeling like you're in space and all that and it's just, it's just not the same. It really is just not the same. But I am going ham right now. This is like my first game on too. I am going ham. Hold on. 24 and 6. Let's do this. There's 12. Oh gosh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That guy think he's slick. He think he's slick. Oh, he's slick. All right. But yeah, that's... We're actually losing. Wow. My team needs to step it up. But yeah, that's just really great news to hear. You know, the fact that they're going to be doing that. And not just for this year. It's for the next three or so years. And, like, it's like, finally, man. Final freaking lead. Everybody's like, yes. Yeah. Everybody's over here, like, freaking just super excited for Call of Duty. And, you know, that's what everybody hoped would happen after, like, I guess the failure of infinite warfare not really failure but like it didn't do as well as previous call of duty like black ops 3 but um you know everybody's just excited for that game to go back to his prime go back to his roots go back to where it came from you know no need to go further into the future because it's not what we need not what we wanted and you know it's just i'm happy I, i'm excited now can't now we gotta wait for the trailer and when they start releasing details and news about it you know maybe it is gonna be in vietnam because that's the rumor if it is that'd be really really dope because you know it'll be actually that'll actually be a cool setting to play in because we haven't done that in call of duty the only th i guess glimmer of it that we saw was in black ops 2 and that was then uh, like one mission and that was like the beginning mission so you know if they do vietnam i think everybody will welcome that it'll just be a welcome change and they have so much to go off of for vietnam because it was such a then you can finally bring back real guns real guns real kill streaks and maps and not i mean not real kill streaks but you know kill streaks that are based off real things you know, I, I'm just excited. Like, don't get me wrong, I like Infinite Warfare, I really do. But it's, you know, it's not what Call of Duty used to be. It's not why I fell in love, fell in love with it in the first place. 
to kind of uh, just de took a detour, took a small left turn on, you know, at a place where it shouldn't have, and uh, kind of just went downhill from there. But um, hopefully everything goes well with 2017's Call of Duty. Hopefully they perform and hopefully they bring a new game that you know everybody wants and hopefully they revise Call of Duty as a whole because that'd be really great but hold on hold on let me slow it down and let me actually win this for my team let me win not get killed but let me win this for my team I was going off in the beginning but now I'm 34 and 14 but I don't really care honestly I'm just trying to play and I am losing 30 oh my gosh okay forget the deaths forget it. oh no please please <laughs> okay come on let's win this let's win this when, oh no 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 oh come on team don't let us lose now do not let us lose now oh there you go two kills two kills there we go there you go there you go there's one oh there's two there's the double that we needed right there clutching it for the team because you know how we do it all right but that's gonna be it for today's video guys if you guys enjoyed this and if you guys are if you guys are excited for the new call of duty coming out 2017 going back to boots on the ground leave a like and a comment down below but this has been your boy joe for snake guys catch you on the next video and remember stay joyful and game on